Good evening and thanks for joining us. New tonight, for the second time in two months, the Arizona State Senate is taking action against one of its most extreme members. In the hours after Saturday, Saturday's massacre in Buffalo, Senator Wendy Rogers spread the falsehood that the federal government was behind the racist attack. Team 12's Bram Resnick has more on what the Senate did and how Rogers is reacting. Bram? Yeah, just minutes ago, Senator Wendy Rogers issued a statement claiming her comment about the massacre was, quote, taken out of context, but she never explained what she meant. Now her fellow senators are investigating. She was true to her word. I do not apologize. I will not back down. That was a defiant Senator Wendy Rogers back in March. Her fellow senators took the rare step of censuring her for threatening to destroy Republicans who opposed her. I move the Senate Committee on Ethics investigate the remarks made by Senator Wendy Rogers. Now, for the second time in two months, Rogers again faces discipline by her fellow senators. Hours after Saturday's massacre in Buffalo, Rogers posted this on her Telegram page, quote, Fedboy summer has started in Buffalo. The far-right Republicans spreading a conspiracy theory that federal employees were behind the racist shootings of African Americans. When I look at this, this, and I'm furious. Rogers is a first-term state senator from Northern Arizona, one of the state's leading election deniers, and an ardent Donald Trump supporter who's also endorsed Republican Carrie Lake for governor. The Senate rejected a motion to expel Rogers, but any punishment recommended by ethics investigators could include banishing Rogers from the Senate. In Phoenix, Bram Resnick, 12 News. All right, Bram, thank you.